What's up guys, Mr. Reverts here, and today we have a new patch update for Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, and it is version 1.18, and it's going to be live across on all platforms by the time you see this video. Now the download is going to be coming in at 1.164 gigabytes, and uh, it's not really too big, but there is some good content in this download. Uh, first off, you're going to notice here that we do have two weapons. The first one is called the Stallion 44, which is basically the 44 Magnum, and then we have the G-Rail, and this is a assault rifle. It's a pretty weird looking weapon. Weapon. I'm gonna have a video on these two guns uh, coming out later today So if you guys want to go check that out uh, make sure to come back to my channel for that And then uh, also we have some new calling cards camos and weapon accessories and gestures So that's pretty cool and then next up here. We just have a couple fixes in the game uh, First off here. We have a fix for the protus and the erad shotgun which alternates not tracking towards contract challenges The next there was a bug fix on all hybrid sites on SMGs losing hip fire reticles when switching between hybrid site modes and the next here allow players players to gain access to the M2187 and the Protus Summer events via supply jump and allows for that variant to unlock the base weapon. And the next, a fix for scrolling issues while in the Mark II collection menu for the Quartermaster. And this next fix here only applies to PC users only, and there's a bug that would cause the screen resolution on PC to not refresh when resizing the game window. I'm not really sure how big the PC community is, but you guys are going to be happy to see that fix. And finally here, there's a bug where calling cards earned in single player would appear in the after action report and multiplayer with placeholder images. I haven't had that come across to me too much in the game. Uh, I have seen some images on Reddit of people getting these uh, weird placeholder images so that's going to be fixed in the game and that is pretty cool. But guys, the main thing here that you want to uh, really pay attention to is the Stallion 44 pistol and the G-Rail assault rifle because these are going to be the two free weapons you get via the season pass or by completing the challenges for Infinite Warfare. So guys, these are the patch notes for this recent update for 1.18. Tell me that's about this in the comment section down below guys because personally I would have liked to see the jitter modding fix for this game because it is getting a little bit crazy uh, recently and I would like to see some more security updates for this game but that's just me personally drop a like if you guys did enjoy and thanks so much for watching I'm a very tough rest of the day until next time I'll see you guys later